What's up, family? I got one very simple message. After hearing the news that my Giants traded Odell Beckham for the 17th pick, Jabril Peppers, in the third round pick. How did they trade him, period? I don't, I don't even want to harp on what the fuck they got back for him. The fact that they traded Odell Beckham. The situation is this. Lewis Riddick was supposed to be our GM. And because one black man ends up representing all black men. Jerry Reese fucked up so bad being our GM. He fucked up so bad. This is why Lewis Riddick is not our GM. Because there was too much shit for getting him in the clean up. Clean up. Any GM to come back and clean up. But he hit a couple of, couple of hits. Landon Collins was one of them. And Odell was another. And in one offseason, you get rid of both. One, you get no compensation for. <laughs> get rid of a future Hall of Famer. Louis Riddick wouldn't have done that. He would not have done this. It's to the point, it's like you really are pissing away the season. You are literally pissing away the season. How do you get rid of, or like, as you say, a gold jacket guy? A guy who's going to wear a gold jacket one day. How do you do that? You don't get rid of a Hall of Famer and get better. I'm going to say this again for a fact. You do not get rid of a Hall of Fame player approaching, not even reached his prime, but approaching his prime because he's yet to play with an elite quarterback. I know how much I love Eli Manning, but Eli Manning at this point in his career is not an elite quarterback. So we have yet to see the best out of Odell Beckham. So he hasn't even touched his prime yet. How do you get rid of a Hall of Famer who has yet to touch his prime? And get better. How? Why? Because he kisses a fucking kicking net? Because he throws his helmet to the ground? Because he's mad we getting our ass whooped? This is enough to get rid of him? That's so much of a problem? I mean, this is reminiscent of the Knicks getting rid of Porzingis. This just shows the dysfunction that's going on. Under. We, we got him. We got rid of Jerry Reese because Jerry Reese was a shitty GM. Let's call it what it is. He was a shitty GM. Gettleman was to come, come, supposed to come in and write the ship. And he's turned us into a fucking laughing stock. We have turned into a fucking laughing stock. This is like the bullshit that the Knicks just did. Getting rid of Porzingis. Now <laughs> you get rid of get rid of old Del Beckham. It's like I don't even want to hear what the compensation is. I get the alert from my phone and I'm fucking like, what? What? Are you serious? What? This is incompetence. This is why you got to settle for Antoine Bethea at safety. You know why? Because when it's an incompetently ran organization, you can't even give the money away. Nobody wants it from you. Sucks to be a Giants fan today. It's not a good day. It's your boy, Urban Sports Guru. Let me know what you think. Salute.